So in the last clip, we had a look at EMG and different ways of measuring muscular activity. Now in this clip, we're going to take a look at ECG and an alternative way of measuring heart rate. Now, as you already noticed, I am connected to this amplifier with Eindhoven 2, which is the negative input connected to my right hand side, the positive input connected to my left foot, and ground is always connected to the right foot. So let's say that we wish to measure specifically pulse. Well, the alternative way of doing this is to use this device here called a pulse oximeter. Now, this is how this works. First of all, switch it on. There we go. And then we take a look at this flashing light inside, which after having inserted my finger in it, it shines through my finger. So this light just shines through my finger and every time that my heart beats, it releases a flow of blood which absorbs some of this light and that is then translated into the signal that we see on the screen. So both of these ways are good uh, regarding measuring heart rate pulse, but this device here also provides us with the blood oxygen levels, which we see here on the side. So in the last two clips, we had a look at the two different modalities, namely acceleration and light absorption in this one. Unfortunately, we've left out the two oldest ones, which are temperature and blood pressure. But we are going to take a look at them in the next clip, where I'm measuring them whilst smoking a cigarette. Thank you.